Alright guys, so welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to be playing Anime Clash. I do want to tell you guys, this is exclusive for only content creators. The game will be releasing tomorrow on Saturday, February 17th. So, just keep that in mind if you guys do want to play the game. There's so many players active right now. I did AFK in the time chamber. I did not get the unit. You don't need an auto clicker. So, if you pull up multi-Roblox, you could literally AFK on 10 different Robloxes. Well, let's get straight into the video. So, nobody else but the content creators, testers, developers, stuff like that can go in the game. So, if you look in our inventory, we currently have nothing. But we can get everything in the game if you want to just by a few simple commands so the only command we really have to do is slash give all units and there we go now we have all the units in the game and just load them all up so one thing interesting about this there's only two commons in the game there's one rare and there is five epics five legendaries and there's like 10 15 mythicals there is so many mythicals in this game if you love zamayoto or yamamoto what do you want to call him strongest one we have gojo you have kirin that's supposed to be sasuke robot gilgamesh just another skin of gilgamesh maybe it is a evo i know there's a lot of evos in this game we have gilgamesh it actually is his real name in here shadow that's sid berserker guts demon king so demon king meliodas excalibur that is saber and then we have king of curses we have sakuna and then we have a normal yamamoto okay and we have kilua law the legendary saber you can probably evolve this legendary one into this mythical one right here so maybe that'll be one of the units you want to go for we have crimson emperor shanks king eskinor obito whoever this is gon naruto ichigo krillin and vegeta those are all the characters in the game of now except for the one unit you can get from the time chamber so make sure you guys do afk to try to get the unit it's going to be super limited if you guys do not know this game is very unique you could actually trade i think on release but you could trade them for robux i'm pretty sure i think rank was saying something about that a while ago i don't remember exactly how it works or not so if you explore the lobby just a little bit they have this swirl thing that AA has with the name above it i think AA had that also we have enchants this is where you can evolve units and roll traits i actually want to try to roll a few traits actually so traits in this game you need gems the one thing is we need level five so we're gonna get level five so you can only evolve yeah you can only evolve shanks and saber wraith now there's only two evos in the game it looks like it could be more units we can't test right now but we can test everything in the game currently there's guild slash leaderboards right here oh, actually this is pretty cool okay there you have a whole station for that next we have story okay so we can progress and there is a tp thing so i don't know i'm walking to all of them there's summons here we are so if you go to summons we have free gems right here what is this you get 160 free gems every four hours premium and vip users receive 220 now when i saw this the last time i went i thought he would just teleport you to the time chamber i don't think he does though so mythicals are really rare a 0 0.1 and we have one common one rare one epic so it's one rarity in all of them there's three banners though i cannot show you guys them because i don't think there's any level commands well, let's give ourselves some gems okay so now we have one million gems so let's go ahead and buy 10 this is what the summoning looks like okay i know like the summoning and re-rolling in this game are really slow apparently like this isn't very fast They only cost 400 for a 10 spin, and then it costs 40 for a normal spin. I don't know if there's VIP or anything to make it cheaper. All right, we just go with that. That's a 30 spin right there. Did we get anything good? I think the best thing we got was an epic. Another epic, another epic. And yeah, nothing good, unfortunately. It's going to be so difficult to get the mythicals, though. The mythicals better be very, very good. So we're going to go ahead and bring a few of them with us. Let's go to our inventory. We got a lot of them. Yeah, let's just equip my favorite anime characters out of all of these. Even if they're a low rarity, I'm still going to equip. So you got my King Gojo. Definitely got to get him on. Gilgamesh is one of my favorite anime characters, but Gilgamesh is definitely up there. I don't know if he's up there with. With the rest of these guys though i'll see if i have extra space for him at the end we have sid berserker guts we have demon king meliodas so i'll definitely take that also we have saber so I, I really like fate i didn't really watch it i watched the movies that's just about it like the movies are peak the anime is just like being dragged on way too long there's too many different series for it so the phase series is one of my favorites so i'm gonna go ahead and bring excalibur and i'm going to bring gilgamesh did i bring the robot one it has more range now i'm gonna bring normal gilgamesh all right let's go ahead and teleport over to the play area so they have universe one mission one so there's a bunch of missions and it goes to what universe two maybe oh is it universe four this looks like a, yeah it's definitely four universes okay let's go ahead and start this is easy now i tried to record this video yesterday and this map wouldn't load so i kind of lost it and just left okay i loaded this time let's go okay so you can pick your difficulty you'll get a certain amount of gems rewards so we'll have two times damage yeah let me let me just go with uh i'm gonna go with medium we have a bunch of mythical units so i think we can do medium we just need a little bit of actually we have excalibur so if you click on her oh she's already placed what the hell i didn't do that damn oh my god wait she's one. Oh wait you could do that debuffing field okay so you can basically debuff the mobs while buffing your unit so let me do oh she got okay guts all right here you are my boy damn oh let me give him a buffing field is he a one tag of character there we go they're getting they're getting towards the end wait this is actually really difficult the units don't seem to respond next wave please wait am i cooked wait i'm cooked you mean match complete i got cooked defeat what do we get from this berserker 1200 damage saber 1200 yeah but i'm not gonna lie these things have like hella spa or something i'm not using those characters again okay so what do we just use so you're getting unequipped you're also getting unequipped we're gonna go 
with Trafalgar Law. He's definitely up there. I would rather have him than Saber. And we're gonna bring Sakuna. All right, try to see if this is a little bit better. Actually, I never thought of leveling up my units. I feel like they don't even really need a level up. Okay, so level one. Okay, maybe we can get to like level five. These things don't even give that much XP. I click confirm. Yeah, it's definitely a feed bug. You get him level eight though. Let's go ahead and go back in here. If you guys are wondering why did I feed all my units, I could just do the command and get it back. It doesn't really matter. Now for the test servers, he still didn't fix everything yet. As you can see, this right here is what I got yesterday and I absolutely lost it. Oh, it loaded. Damn, this is actually a pretty nice map. I wasn't even looking at it. Oh, damn. Sukuna's really cheap. Let me place him. Can I see what he does? Apparently not. You can place three of him. Okay. Decent placement. So Shadow, he has, or he costs 2,200 yen. I want to place Gilgamesh. I heard Gilgamesh has a really nice attack. So I placed them far away. They just have like a lot of range. Meteor. What do you mean meteor? Damn. Wait, it didn't even hit him. There we go. I feel like if you kill the mobs, there's a chance you get it. So we can place... Oh, wait, I can place Gojo, though. Okay, Gojo's gonna place... Oh, wait, I can see his stuff. Wait, I can't see these guys' stuff. I don't know if it's broken or not. So he has 100 damage, 30 range, 60 HP. Um, that doesn't seem very good, man. This is a mythical? Okay, so I can't click off of it now. I can't upgrade him. But he is upgraded. Okay, it was free to upgrade him. Now he has 100... Or he has 46 range and 30 damage. What the hell? 6.5 enemy damage boost. 6. Point, um, we could talk about this, eh? Place Gilgamesh. Oh, he's a lot of health. Who is this guy right here? Strong Shinobi. Damn. Wait, who was that? Ooh, what the hell? Wait, he does 30 damage. Why is my boy doing a hollow purple? Wait, he costs one to upgrade. Oh, yeah, max him out. 177 health. Okay, wait, so it says their skill right there. So he does purple. He does Eilish. Those are the only two I can really click on. Sakuna is not, like, working with. I know there's still a few bugs in the game. They didn't really fix everything. I'm hoping that they update these servers before, like, releasing the game. Because there's just too many bugs in this right now. Apparently, the attack animations are way off, too, I heard. But let's go ahead and place down shadow there he is damn okay and it looks like the upgrades are free as long as you have enough money for the first upgrade it's 10 range right now 75 damage 50 hp skills atomic that's why that's why it's so expensive to place we just randomly place them i don't know if they stay like that all right let's max out our shadow now oh my god what the hell well, he's going crazy. Wait, how much range does he have? He has 210 range. It does not say his SPA. I wish it did. So you can already see right here, Nuke. Gojo is a ranger. Okay, he only has like 10 SPA. Wait, he's going crazy. And if they walk into that while he's using his ability, he still kills them, it looks like. He doesn't have a singular kill somehow, though. Once in, they're all in range now. Oh, yeah, there you go. Oh, my God. Wait, it's not hitting them. Does it, does it like hit one person? He doesn't even have a kill yet. Wow. Sidious so looks there and looks pretty okay. My boy's doing nothing. Who are you attacking now? There is nobody over here. Wait, okay, whatever. All right, let's see you all now. 480. 85 health is a special ranger his ability is shot he only has 39 range so let's see what he does oh is that is that him i don't know if it's him or not okay he did shoot right there indeed we've not tried meliodas yet though meliodas has to be beagle it's instant max he's a ranger 25 damage 104 hp 55 range his ability is swings That says swings? Wait, that's a 55 range ability? Hello? Wait, actually, and Sid has 210 range. It should be this entire map. Unless the range is just that bad in this game, which I would hope is not that bad. We can't max out Sakuna or stuff like that because they don't work. All right, now we just go ahead and max out, like, the rest of the Sids. You can actually place more than one of him? Why is that allowed? I can't upgrade him, though. Wait, how many of them can you place? Not enough money. I can't upgrade. Wait, so this one does 6,000 damage on placement. This one does 6,000 damage also. Yeah, this thing's completely broke. Oh, is it just showing his AoE? Oh, this is AoE. He's a circle AoE. It's not even full map, too. 1,000 HP. Oh, we can debuff this guy. Actually, let me try a meteor on him. How much? 20 damage. Debuffing field. Buffing field. Meteor. Damn, he's cooked. Oh my god. There we go. Easily beat that. Most Yeah, I'm obviously the most valuable player. My units, my best one was Shadow. Shadow finally went to lock in the like, last second. I think it might have been these guys right here. But my second strongest unit was Meliodas. Wow. Oh Yeah, it doesn't go by kills. So that means that those other units I had equipped at the entire time were doing no damage. Alright, so I'm not about to do all that. I know there's got to be command for this. So we're going to do slash it stat. Oh! Oh, it actually worked. Wait, I'm so smart. Wait, that was just so random. Okay. So we could just go over here and reroll on our units right here. So our best units, I would say the best unit right now is Sid. So we could roll. We got Shadow. So there is a lot of traits. They've all been leaked already. So it doesn't really matter if I show them. Shadow is a rare trait. Overheat. Overheat is another rare trait. It's a 10 percent for that. Frozen. Frozen is also a rare trait. Predator, also a rare tree. Also another rare tree. Iron Wall. Okay, we've gotten all the rare traits, I'm pretty sure. Wait, what is the chance for 9%? Okay, let's try to get one of these. Jack of all trades. Highlights it with the rarity. Okay, so then we will know. So we got Jack of all trades. I don't exactly know what they do. There's no index for some reason. Let's keep rolling though. Try to get a better rarity or even the other epics. Get Clutch. Okay. Jack of all trades once again. Maybe we could get a legendary. What's the chance? A 0 0.9. Oh no suffocation clutch okay we're getting a bunch of them now clutch again all for one damn we just got three of them in a row suffocation again so if i just started the game and i, I rolled on three different units and got those i would have been happy 
Oh, look at that. You rerolled pure pressure for unit shadow. Except. Okay. Well, we got a legendary. We got pure pressure. I want to try this. I don't know how good it's going to be. The units are kind of bugged right now. Maybe we could try to roll on the other units. Like my boy right here. If you roll a legendary or above, it would just like stop it like you did right there. And one thing is, it's like over 40,000 gems to get one legendary. It costs 350. Yeah, so that's like. Oh, wait, is there a pity system in this game? There's got to be. Because that looks like the perfect amount of gems for the percentage. It actually rolls so fast. Wait, auto clicker? Wait, let's see if zero milliseconds. Okay, never mind. I was going as fast as you could already. Okay, there we go. You reroll double down for your unit. Strongest one. Okay. That is a wait, is that a mythical? Oh my god. We actually just got one of the mythicals. That is insane. This isn't the tester servers, unfortunately, but a mythical is still a mythical. We're gonna showcase that in a minute. Now let's try to get something decent on this guy right here. I want to try out a few of the epics. So you have cheapskate. I already know what that'll do. You rolled pure pressure. Well, I'll definitely take that. Clutch. Okay, we'll go with that. So now we click on this guy. This guy is my best unit right now. He has a mythical trait. Sid has a legendary. This guy has no, this guy's an epic. This guy's a legendary, I think. And this guy's a legendary. I don't know. I have, I have a mythical and a few legendaries. Let's go ahead and test them. See if they're any good. We're on mission two now. So there's a random wave where they just randomly have 6.5 times damage. Isn't that a little bit too much? The health is already bad enough, but damage is going to one shot my Sagunas. So the strongest one is who I got the mythical trait on. So let's go ahead and place him down. There we go. 100 damage on placement. Literally the same without the trait. So it's not going to show me, it looks like. Oh, and they fixed the money upgrade. There we go. So now it's actually normal. I don't exactly know what the traits do. Boy's already doing a hollow purple. Oh, we already got to max out. Okay, maybe they did didn't fix it okay so gojo right now he looks like a circle even though he's hollow purple which is clearly a line aoe but okay 30 damage 100 hp 46 range what are you the same as it was on placement so the traits aren't factored in nothing's factored in i don't even know what's going on to be honest yeah because instead of gaining damage it took all of it and again a little bit of health and range okay Dude, why are these guys sprinting wait double hollow purple get out of here 200 wait gojo's getting mixed sakuna lock in there we go w sakunas All right, so let's go ahead and place down Meliodas now. I think it was another person I got to go trade on. We maxed him out. Why not? We maxed this one out too. Wait, what? Oh, none of my units want to attack. Okay. All right, but guys, that is going to be for this video. If you guys do want to try to get a new unit, it is a free unit you could possibly get. Go ahead and sit in the hyperbolic time chamber right here next to Gilgamesh. If you go over, I think it instantly teleports you in here anyway. But this is what the game looks like. The models right here, they just have them all out like this. They did fix up the UI. If you guys did see the leaked screenshot, thankfully they fixed it because it looked terrible in my opinion. Feed 300 enemies. You get a lot of gems while doing these two. Those are daily, then weekly quests. It doesn't show them. Okay. Story. It shows the story quest at least. We get 50 gems for this one but let's go back over to the time chamber let me enter there is a command that will allow me in here anyway let me go in here it loads so you do not need an auto clicker by the way there is so many people active on this game right now and it's mostly just for this unit it's going to be worth a lot so right now it shows my total stuff whenever the game comes out it will erase all this so don't worry i'm going to keep none of the units there is a 0.05 chance of you actually getting the unit it's supposed to say the percentages right here but let's go back to lobby actually and again it is a 0.05 every reward so every minute you have a 0.05 percent chance to go into the time chamber i just have to do this i think it's just the same exact thing but if i do that it'll just teleport me into the time chamber and now we could sit in here i don't know if it's with other players or not i don't know if it'll put me in a public game okay there we go now it's fixed so that one was a whole different time chamber for some reason so right now we're getting a total of 8,000 coins 4,000 gems you paid out every minute in the event unit you can only get one of them but it is a 0.05 percent it does not kick you up with an auto clicker if you do have multi roblox then i suggest putting up a bunch of alt accounts and trying to get the unit because it will be tradable eventually i don't know if it's tradable right when the game releases or not but yeah guys thank you guys for watching i will be afking this on a few different accounts trying to get the unit to showcase it when the update drops peace